Hi, I'm Mike Elliott, and you're watching CEO Live TV. Today, we're joined by Mr. Avi Reichenthal. He's the co-chairman at Nano Dimension, a leader in the field of 3D printed electronics, which trades in the NASDAQ under ticker NNDM. Mr. Reichenthal spent 12 years guiding 3D systems as president, chief executive officer, and director. Under his leadership, 3D Systems emerged as a leading provider of 3D printing services, along with becoming a leading voice in the industry. During his watch, the company realized significant revenue and valuation growth and ranked 13th on Forbes' list of the world's most innovative growth companies in 2014, as well as Fortune Magazine's fifth fastest growing company and second fastest growing tech company in 2013. Nano Dimension is a leading additive manufacturing technology company that we've been following for some time. They're disrupting, reshaping, and defining the future of how electronics are made. With its unique 3D printing technologies, Nano Dimension is targeting the growing demand for electronic devices that require increasingly sophisticated features and rely on printed circuit boards. Good afternoon, Avi. Thanks for joining us. It's really good to be here, Mike. To begin, please tell us about your background and how you got involved in the additive manufacturing industry. Well, my uh, background is uh, background of uh, a young immigrant that came to the promised land uh, nearly some 40 years ago uh, and discovered the, the convergence of uh, science, technology, engineering, and business. And I uh, got to live the, the American dream first uh, with uh, a great company called uh, Sealed Air Corporation, a uh, New York Stock Exchange company that uh, uh, we built to become one of the major uh, powers in protective packaging and food packaging. Uh, and then for the last 15 years, uh, a journey uh, through additive manufacturing and really coming in uh, right at the inflection point and getting to build a great company, 3D Systems, uh, that uh, really to a large extent uh, put additive manufacturing on the map as we know it today. A real privileged journey that I'm really grateful for. Well, you're considered a visionary in 3D in the 3D printing industry. Can you tell us how you see the overall market for additive manufacturing technologies evolving in the coming years, and where some of the biggest industrial uses might be? Yeah. I, I I think that uh, 3D printing uh, slash additive manufacturing is an unstoppable force in in. Uh, really uh, defining and transforming manufacturing as we know it. There is a lot of talk today, as you know, about uh, Industry 4.0, uh, and, and it goes hand in glove with uh, additive manufacturing and the whole digital transformation of uh, manufacturing as we know it. You will see it predominantly in aerospace, automotive, and durable goods. And within that, I think uh, metal 3D printing uh, at scale, alternatives to plastic molding, injection molding at scale, and the whole electrification of geometries and encapsulation of sensors and conductive paths to enable more of a cognitive connected lifestyle and world will be driving forces in additive. And from your perspective as an industry veteran and someone who's literally helped shape the genesis of 3D printing in general, what do you see as Nano Dimension's biggest strengths as uh, they build market share? Well, n n n Nano Dimension is really the first and, and only company that has the ability first to reshape and disrupt uh, how printed circuit boards are made in terms of really compressing the time to design and time to market of complex electronic devices, which as you know, govern everything and, 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 and uh, dominate everything that we do today. Everybody walks around with connected gadgets uh, all day long. Uh, but even more than that, uh, it has the ability to electrify geometries. And what I mean by that is that increasingly devices and hardware is meshed with software connected together. Uh, you need the ability to electrify geometries, you need the ability to encapsulate sensors, you need the ability to deliver smart functional assemblies and components, and nano dimension is really at the heart of enabling that kind of electrification at scale. And Avi, that's all the questions we had for today. Is there anything else you think investors uh, in particular might want to take note of in regards to nanodimension? I think that nanodimension 
blockchain has the technology, it has the uh, innovative abilities, and now is building uh, a convincing access to market, both in terms of its geographical expansion and uh, its investment in customer experience centers. Uh, and the product itself, which is an award-winning product, uh, is a pretty uh, exciting entry into the market, which is still in its nascent state. Avi, an honor to meet you. Real pleasure to have you on the show. And uh, we hope to be able to speak with you again soon. Thank you very much, Mike. Same. Thank you. You've been watching CEO Live TV, and we've been talking to Mr. Avi Reichenthal. He is the co-chairman at Nano Dimension, a leader in the field of 3D printed electronics, which trades on the NASDAQ under ticker NNDM. With 56% of all worldwide 3D printing revenue projected to be driven by demand for faster and cheaper prototypes, there will be a growing need for innovative solutions like the Dragonfly 2020 and Dragonfly 2020 Pro 3D printers. And with global 3D printing sales predicted to reach $35 billion by 2020, Nano's patented 3D printing technology seems well positioned to grab market share and build value for shareholders. To learn more about them, please visit their website at www.nano-di.com. Thank you for watching CEO Live TV.